Hi and welcome to this Blueberry Markets video update with me John Kibler, Head Currency Analyst. In this video we're going to take a look at the Euro Australian Dollar as we expect this market to continue to decline potentially back into the trend line support. We spoke about this market before, we spoke about it in our market outlook. Uh, the reason there was no post yesterday, by the way, as well, that was obviously uh, a holiday in the US. So there's no real point in looking at any kind of significant moves in the market. However, you know, going to this weekly time frame on Euro Oz, saw a nice bearish engulfing candle form from these previous structure highs uh, in here, suggesting that we are going to see a little bit of downside to this. The Australian dollar is actually gaining some strength today um, ahead of the RBA meeting, um, which they are likely to hold interest rates and potentially boost the, the Australian dollar. Some news out of the US and uh, China. In regards to the trade talks, Donald Trump has recently tweeted suggesting that the trade talks are back on and the negotiations are going well again. Uh, how long this will last, I do not know. Um, but uh, at the end of the day, um, they are talking um, a good game at the minute and the Australian dollar is benefiting off the back of that. So looking for Aussie buys. Uh, especially against the uh, kind of weaker currencies, uh, weaker currencies being at the minute the Canadian dollar and the euro. So going down to a four hour time frame, we can see we're starting to get some nice cyclicity here now uh, on the euro Aussie. If I bring in the 20 and 50 moving average, you can see that has crossed now. And uh, just looking to play those averages, just looking for the bounces in here. So expecting a pullback into the averages, into these highs, nice little bit of resistance lows coming in there as well. Looking for a move back down. Um, and, you know, I'm going to look for targets around about this trend line support. So looking for that Euro Aussie downside now that the moving averages have crossed nicely. Um, we'll look to get that move in um, as the market continues its downtrend on the four hour time frame. So hope you enjoyed this video update. Um, it's been John Kibler, Head Currency Analyst at Blueberry Markets. I'll speak to you soon.